Hi guys, I'm Brother Specs, and this is my first tutorial. And my tutorial is all about how to put play and replay button in your animation using Action Script 2. Um, maybe other people know this already, but maybe others don't know yet, so I made this tutorial. And now, um, this animation will be my example. Now let's put this animation a play and replay button. In frame 1, let's make that frame empty. Because in that frame, there we will put the play button. So I will hold the frame and the frame 1 and drag it into frame 2. Now it's empty, let's make the play button. Click the selection tool and now you can move it and put it wherever you want. And I will put it there. Convert it into symbol and name it play button. The type must be button. Now click the play button and then right click or press F9. And let's put the commands on, open parenthesis, press or release. Just choose and then open brace enter and then in the second line here let's put play and don't forget to put stop command in frame 1 so that if you test this animation or your play button it will not directly play the animation it will stay in frame 1 where play button is and let's test there the play button is there and we have play button already and let's try and the animation play so let's make the replay button let's put it in the last part of your animation in the last part of your animation make a new frame empty frame and let's make a replay button selection tool and move it wherever you want again or put it wherever you want and then convert it into symbol name it replay button the type must be button and then let's put the commands on press pen brace and in the line 2, let's put the command go to and play. Open and close parenthesis. Between the open and close parenthesis, we must put the frame number. The frame number that if we click the replay button, it will go back directly depending on what frame number we put on it so I will put frame 1 and put also stop here so let's test play and there play and after the animation the replay button will appear and if we click the replay button it must go back into frame 1 where we will find the play button there
so that's all hope you like this tutorial and I mean hope you learned something thanks